Hey guys, it's a new day. Oh my god, I'm gonna get in here. It's a bit windy. Um, it's a new day. I tried to get as much done as I could yesterday. Um, I'm getting nowhere. Actually, why am I saying that? Um, I managed to replace the oil seal, the crankshaft seal itself. I can't show you right now because the car, the wheel's back on. I managed to take the pulley off. Um, you can see from the clips that, yeah. <clears throat> and then um, the trouble was getting the pulley back on. Um, I don't know if you remember, but I ordered the wrong part. So this one's the one inch driver. Uh, the head on it. Um, my mate's gonna sort me out with a half inch and then I should be able to uh, put the pulley back on with no problems and then I'm pretty sure, I'll show you later when the car's back on jack stands and stuff, but I'm pretty sure the oil leak is actually from the oil cooler. Um, I had a, a hunch before that it was the oil cooler but um, looking at it now it's like pretty much like it's coming from around that area so I'm gonna assess that and I've also I've already ordered the O-rings from a few months ago, so I'm gonna replace that as well today. I mean, it's there, so I might as well do it. Um, so today, hopefully, it's gonna look, it's gonna be back to normal. Um, I'm gonna be able to drive my car again. It feels weird not driving my car, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Um, it'll be uploaded later this evening or tomorrow. I'm sorry, guys, but yeah, cheers. So, a little update. Um, I love being with car guys because they just do, they just sort you out. So my friend Liam, who owns a DC2, works at um, a tool hiring place. So he's hooked it up with all the tools that I need. I'm gonna go return the 25 mil back because that was too big. Jeff sorted me out some arches. Hagen sorted me out the old seal. Ah, uh, good friends, good friends. But, so this is the, this is where we're at. Um, basically, I had this replacement bolt um, just to start the threads because this, um, that was too small and I couldn't reach the threads, but, I started off with this and then I realised um, Liam told me to take it out and uh, it started running off the edges so he just said uh, put the old one, the original back in, back on in and it seems to be working. So pass you over to uh, Liam. Um, hopefully, I've got an idea that this isn't what's causing the leak. Tighten it with the breaker bar, and it should have a torque setting, but I don't have a, a torque wrench, and I don't have the patience for that right now. I just want to get my car back on the road, so no judging. So that's tight now, as tight as I can get it. Um, so big shout out to Liam again, Liam. <clears throat> I know you're watching this vlog. Cheers, man. I really appreciate your support and help with all this, um, this trouble. <laughs> but anyway, uh, I'm pretty sure. I was looking at it proper closely, uh, where the oil leak is and stuff. Um, focus, bitch. Right, so that's the. Oh, you see those two hoses there? Hang on, those two hoses. Yeah, well, that's the whole, um, That metal bit there oh, is the oil cooler, and it's proper, proper dirty around that area. So there's actually two O-rings connected behind that metal plate that joins the oil cooler to the oil filter house housing so that's what I'm gonna swap I mean I ordered the two o-rings like I ordered the two o-rings like two three months ago so now I've got the chance to actually change them um, so you know killing two birds with one stone I guess so um, I'm feeling optimistic today um, hopefully my car will be back on the road and uh, hopefully no more oil leak but I do plan on um, fixing the oil pan gasket as well and probably the head head cover gasket um, replacing as much as I can but I don't know yet that's me we're talking about here <laughs> but hopefully I'm done with this now I just want to get it back together right I'm finally done um, finally well, like I said that's all done now and I've managed to change the oil filter um, not the oil filter the oil cooler o-rings it was so fiddly it was so fiddly but yeah, everything's back together. I made a little bit of a mess, but hey. Um, so now I've just got to put the pulley back on, take the Allen key out of that second hole, um, put the arch line back, top my car up with oil, and then fingers crossed that's the oil leak fixed. So I'm, I'm buzzing to get my car on the road now. Um, the first thing I'm gonna do is probably just gonna end the video at Costa 
um, edit that and then um, upload it and then yeah just drive around and um, I might give my car a wash today I might try and sort this out maybe too who knows but yeah my mood's been elevated now so whew. yeah we'll carry on hey guys so this is actually day three of me trying to fix my oil leak um, yesterday or the day before yesterday it, it was yesterday I managed to fix the two o-rings on the oil cooler but I managed to um, fuck up one of the o-rings because it got pinched and um, thus it just left a puddle of oil everywhere um, if you guys know Eliminate from America, I did an Eliminate moment because they always are uh, renowned for um, spilling oil or sp spilling fluids. So that's what happened to my car. It starts fine though, the crankshaft's fine, it's running, but yeah, I need to sort out the oil cooler. I've just picked up some new parts. I walked over to, um, I went to a BMW parts um, place and uh, got myself some two rings. So hopefully today, I also picked up four liters of oil today. So I'm um, feeling optimistic today. Uh, yeah, let's just get today started. This is gonna be like part two, I guess, or part three, I don't know. That's what I meant by spilling a puddle of oil everywhere. Whoopsies. Uh, let's just get it finished. I'm here guys, I'm joined by Jeffrey behind the camera, Hagen and Yusuf that came for moral support. I managed to fix my two O-rings on my oil cooler. I'm not gonna bother showing you, but yeah, I'm just letting the car run now and then I'm gonna turn it off and then see if there's any oil leaks. If not, then done. What up, motherfuckers? Dang. Um, he's down here, mate. He's down here. Can't find him. Hello, Yus. It's still leaking. Is it still leaking? A little bit. Where? See it. Still there, Right. So if you like Ronnie's channel, make sure you go. <laughs> <Come on>. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure to go subscribe to me because I've got far better content, you know. Oh. Like, <laughs> what are you saying? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. You're, you're you throwing digs, Jeff? You throwing is digs? It, is it leaking then? It's still leaking, but I'm just going to tighten them up. It's leaking like your bum hole on that, Jeff. <laughs> so dirty. I know. Right so, how's your car, mate? Um, dead. Actually, no, to be fair. So. Oh, Jeff and he behind the camera here has kindly supplied me with everything I need from silver. I'm, I'm like the best mate out of all you lot. I supplied you a whole front end, super cheap. I supplied you, what was it, That's aero what I mean. skirts. That's what I mean. You supplied me with aero skirts. aero skirts and arches. Hagen supplied me with the seal and Liam supplied me with the tools. Yeah. So I supplied you with friendship. <laughs> friendship and love. <laughs> And I super cheap aero skirts as well. Love. Ten pound uh, each for your aero skirts. How much which are they I haven't normally? seen yet. Yeah, but they are a bit like ropey. But oh god, that was sketchy. But like, how much are they worth normally? Two hundred eighty. Yeah, so, so I've got it for uh, ten pound each. Ten pound each, but they are a bit. You coming out tonight? Yeah, yes. We have to get this on oh. film. Just to... don't pressure me. No, he's not here for New Year. No, nah. I'm in dupes. He's in dupes. <laughs> me and you have got to hang out. Yeah, but I don't Yay. really. Don't vlog. Really. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> huh? Nothing, nothing. Hmm? Nothing, nothing. Huh? I'm just gonna go outside for a little bit. He said don't vlog me. Hmm? I don't smoke. Oh, you're not gonna put this No, guys, me. just don't buy minis, they're shit. <laughs> Where the fuck's your garbage? Where's this garbage? Stacked into a wall. <laughs> turn it off. It's running, so I'm gonna run it. It's just... Right, so we went to Halfords, got some tools, and now we're back at Ron's. He's gonna give. Another go at fixing his car. Probably won't. So right? fuck off. <laughs> what was it then? Was it that actually? It was the uh, oil filter. It wasn't secured. Oh no! What's My happened? light's gone. <laughs> Shut up. For fuck's sake! Is it left? Your camera's not focusing. You got a tap it. Yeah, no. It says autofocus not enabled. Hang on. Done a whole fucking lap round. We're already on the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> 
What do you usually say? He eyebrow, he either sits there, in the corner, or you don't. I don't. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, have those two spots. So I say, I'm everywhere. <laughs> How much are you paying them this time? Are you exposing me? No, I'm not exposing <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just don't talk about that right now, please. She's on a gang gang thing. Oh, I'm not saying that. I'm not. <laughs> Only between us, yeah. <laughs> so guys, um, sorry about the vlogs. They've been a bit like scattered about, and um, there's no really like no schedule to it. But um, I didn't fix my oil leak. You said found the problem. I think there's like um, an oil filter. That's loose, so I've got to tighten that up. But the leak's not as bad as it used as it used to be. So just let me enjoy my uh, donut. Lemon's lemon's now. Lemon top. Good. Good. But yeah, the upload schedule will be back um, back on track as of Saturday. So um, yeah, I'm just gonna end the video. Sorry, I'm a bit hungover. Yo. This guy oh. drove to Scotland and back in one night. Good 16 hour drive. Oh my god. Never again. So we're just gonna enjoy Costa and then uh, that's me signing out. Peace. So I'll be your